today I'm going to be talking about my protein, and that is DNA polymerase. Basically, when you're looking at the structure, these are all the forms that it can come in. What does it do? Well, the main function of DNA polymerase is to make DNA from nucleotides. What that means is, despite the several variants that it has, its main function is to replicate DNA. Family A is where we're going to start with. Uh, it was discovered 50 years ago, and the first of the many forms to be solved. Uh, this family overall carries out the bulk genomic replication of the cells. Next, we're moving on to family B. Family B consists mainly of reproductive enzymes found in eukaryotes. Um, it's made from very long multi-subunit enzymes. Uh, and also, family B enzymes also contain an associated three to five exonuclease. Family X, we move on to, there's, they're made up of small monomeric polymerases, uh, participate in filling short gaps in DNA repair. Uh, a feature that most of the members show is that they're present in the N-terminal 8, uh, and they're actually a good binding dominant or binding domain. Uh, they can be found in viruses, bacteria, yeast, and, and mammals. Next, we're moving on to family Y. None of the polymerase in this family show any sort of exonuclease activity. Uh, they have a loose DNA binding pocket or nascent base pair. And because of this, these enzymes are actually able to accommodate distorted DNA structures in their active sites. So if the cell fails to repair itself, if the DNA is messed up, these guys will come in and fix it. And that is DNA polymerase. And it's basically a protein that helps your body function and it is what keeps us alive.